Are these altars? Interesting, because my first thought was, are we going to make it out of this place alive? <laughs> its decor is indeed the opposite of inviting. These look like the statue I picked up. If there is a reason for everything, and one could argue that everything has no reason. Regardless, you know what you must do, don't you? Deliver unto us the remnants of our past. Restore them to their rightful place. Only got two legs here, you know.
his presence. of the Vale is intertwined with the Gi, for they first came to these lands many millennia ago. This sanctuary is proof of their persistence, for it was built to ensure that they never escaped. But if they were sealed away thousands of years ago, how'd they break out and attack the Vale? That I cannot answer. Only the key themselves could. But enough about them. You are here to learn about yourself, Nanaki. This cave serves as a boundary between our world and that of the Gi. It was vital to them and their plans. Were the Gi to seize control of it, the canyon would be doomed. And the people. When the Gi moved against us yet again, a certain Watcher recalled this vulnerability. Huh? Since time was of the essence, he entered the cave without reinforcements, as he had feared. It was teeming with Gi, ready to descend upon the village. Determined to protect the Vale, he pushed from one foe to the next, felling all who dared oppose him. Hold on. If there was a watcher who single-handedly saved the canyon, how come I've never heard of them? <laughs> For now, you should focus on your own struggles with the Gi. Their malice grows more potent.
the course. Open this thing. How oh, indeed? Ideas, Nanaki? Hey, fight's not over yet! 
me of those altars. <laughs> there is a similarity, yes. But this sanctum is much more ancient and serves a rather different purpose. The altars we came upon before were built to imprison the key. This, however, was built to provide the Cetra with a means to commune with them. Commune with them? Why would the Cetra do that? The Gi were the enemy. <laughs> Good and evil friend and foe. Dichotomy is not set in stone, as mutable as the winds. But for now, Nanaki, let us concentrate on the matter at hand, clearing a path to the truth. himself the burden of our hope. <laughs> 